Yes, good afternoon. This is Eric Sanders from the Santa Fe PC. And today I want to talk a little bit about payday loans. Uh, payday loans is, is uh, you know, something that is of particular interest to me because you see this generally in areas where there are people of color and African American and Hispanic, as well as Caucasians that are in the lower economic scale within their community as well. Payday loans, are, as far as I'm concerned, just another form of predatory lending. And you have to be cognizant of it because it may look like a cheap loan, but percentage-wise, it really is predatory lending. And what it boils down to is that you go for a payday loan, let's say you wanted to get a check and you want to get $200, you wind up paying back $300, for example, or you know, almost double the money uh, within a week or two weeks. You know, that's not a way to secure money. Matter of fact, that will make you more economically poor than for you to uh, help have other people that are professional to help you employ strategies to do things to help you with your own budget to save money. So you have companies out here that are preying on people because they know that the people at their target market is are not sophisticated to under, sophisticated enough to understand. It's not meant to be a, a dis, besmirching with character. It's meant to talk about the financial in, uh, instruments that are being used. They're not sophisticated enough to look at the actual note to see that they're not paying 2% or 1%, they're paying 100% if you look at the percentages once you, you aggregate the money and look at what you're paying back. So my message to you is that if you're going to do a payday loan, first of all, you should stay away from it. That, that's really my real recommendation. And what's particularly concerning is some of these small companies, are, they operate on their own, but what's really, really disturbing is sometimes some of the larger banks have smaller companies, of course they don't use their big names, but they use other company names that are actually part of a larger institution where they're taking advantage of people. We've seen that in the past with settlements with predatory lending with uh, certain big companies, certain big banks, which I won't mention. You can do the research, you'll find out who they are, but it's the same problem with predatory lending. So my suggestion about payday loans, stay away from them. And if you do get taken advantage of with payday loans, you might want to consider an attorney. And you know, you might have a class action because they're doing it in particular areas where people are not sophisticated, in particular the people of color where they're being taken advantage of. So remember, payday loans, bad business. Stay away from payday loans because it will violate your civil rights to manage your own affairs and your own property. Thank you.